Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install MinGWW64 on Windows 10 or 11. First, let's go ahead and go to Google and type MinGW space GNU compiler. Press enter and go to the first search result. Here, as you can see, uh, we have almost 4 million downloads just this week. Okay, so just click on the green download button, wait for the file to download and click on the file to start the installation process. So this is the MinGW installation window. Here, all you have to do is click on the install button. Now here, make sure you're installing it to C slash MinGW. Click continue button and just wait for the files to be downloaded. Now you might run into this error. There is no script engine for file extension JS. It doesn't really mean anything. So just keep clicking OK. Now on this next window, we need to add packages by clicking on the checkbox. So go ahead and click here and click mark for installation. Now you have to do that for every single checkbox on the list. Now in the upper left corner, click on installation and then click apply changes. Now to install MinGW is going to take about five minutes. So I'm just going to speed up this video. Once this first window is going to download and install files, this other window will show up. And once that's done, just click on the close button on that window. Okay, at this point, MinGW is installed, but there's one important step we still need to do. Go to start button and start typing environment variables. You don't even have to finish typing it. Just click on the open button. Now on this window that shows up, go ahead and click on the environment variables button. Go to the second box below and scroll down where you see path. Click on path and click on the edit button. Now click on the new button and start typing C slash MinGW slash bin folder. It's important not to add MinGW by itself. Bin folder is the one you're looking for. Now click on the OK button. OK, OK. At this point, your MinGW is fully installed. So let's go ahead and check if it's successfully set up on our Windows 10 or 11 computer. To do that, go ahead and open the command prompt. And on the command prompt, type G++ dash dash version and press enter. Now, if you see MinGW version here, this means that MinGW is successfully installed on your system.